Condiments are food additives that are used to enhance the flavor of dishes. The use of condiments dates back to ancient times when people used spices and herbs to add flavor to their food. Different cultures have their unique condiments, and the history of condiments is closely tied to the history of trade and the exchange of ideas and ingredients between different cultures. Ketchup is a type of condiment made from tomatoes, vinegar, sugar, and spices. It's believed to have originated in China, where it's made from fermented fish and spices. The word ketchup is derived from the Chinese word ketsia, which was a type of sauce made from pickled fish. Ketchup was introduced to the West in the late 17th century, where it was originally made from mushrooms or other vegetables. In the 19th century, ketchup made from tomatoes became more popular, and it's now one of the most widely used condiments in the world. The exact recipe for ketchup varied depending on the region and the available ingredients. One of the earliest known recipes for ketchup was published in an English cookbook in 1727. This recipe called for mushrooms, shallots, and red wine to be cooked down and then mixed with vinegar, salt, and spices. Other early recipes for ketchup used ingredients such as anchovies, walnuts, and oysters. It wasn't until the 19th century that ketchup made from tomatoes became more widespread. Tomatoes were initially used as a cheaper substitute for other ingredients, but they eventually became the primary ingredient in most ketchup recipes. Today, ketchup is typically made from tomatoes, vinegar, sugar, and a blend of spices. We go into the factories of the Heinz Company to see how one of the world's favorite condiments is made, Heinz Tomato Ketchup. Heinz is a well-known food company that was founded in 1869 by Henry John Heinz. The company is based in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, and is known for its various food products, including ketchup, mustard, vinegar, and baked beans. Henry John Heinz was the son of German immigrants who had settled in Pennsylvania. He grew up working in his family's small grocery store, where he learned about food and the food industry. After completing his education, Heinz started his own food company in 1869 initially focusing on producing bottled horseradish. Heinz quickly expanded his product line to include other condiments, such as vinegar and pickles, and he also began to experiment with new methods of food preservation. In 1876, Heinz introduced his famous 57 varieties slogan, which became a well-known brand for the company. Over the years, Heinz continued to grow and expand, introducing new products and establishing itself as a leader in the food industry. Today, Heinz is known worldwide for its high quality products and is a trusted brand in many countries. In addition to sourcing its ingredients from trusted suppliers, Heinz also works with its suppliers to implement sustainable farming practices, such as reducing water usage and minimizing the use of pesticides. This helps to ensure that the ingredients used in Heinz ketchup are of the highest quality while also being environmentally friendly. Heinz ketchup is made using a combination of tomatoes, vinegar, sugar, salt, and a blend of spices. The tomatoes used in Heinz ketchup are grown on farms in the United States and Canada, and they are picked by hand when they are ripe. Commercial tomato farms are agricultural operations that grow tomatoes for sale in the fresh market or for processing into products such as tomato sauce, ketchup, and canned tomatoes. Tomato farming can be done on a small scale, with farmers growing a few acres of tomatoes, or on a large scale, with farmers covering hundreds or even thousands of acres. Tomatoes are usually grown in open fields or greenhouses depending on the climate and the type of tomato being grown. In open fields, tomatoes are usually grown in rows, with the plants spaced out to allow for proper sunlight and air circulation. Greenhouses, on the other hand, are enclosed structures that use artificial light and heating to create a controlled environment for growing tomatoes. Commercial tomato farms use a variety of techniques to optimize tomato production. 
including fertilization, irrigation, pest control, and pruning. They may also use mechanical equipment, such as tractors and harvesters, to plant, cultivate, and harvest the tomatoes. After the tomatoes are harvested, they are washed and cut into small pieces. The tomato pieces are then cooked down to a thick paste, which is mixed with vinegar, sugar, salt, and the secret blend of spices that gives Heinz ketchup its unique flavor. The mixture is then filtered to remove any seeds or skin, and it's cooked again to reduce the moisture content. This helps to thicken the ketchup and gives it the desired consistency. The cooking process also helps to sterilize the ketchup and extend its shelf life. Heinz ketchup is made using a carefully controlled process to ensure that it has a consistent flavor and texture. The company uses high quality ingredients and follows strict food safety guidelines to ensure that its products meet the highest standards of quality. After cooking, the ketchup is cooled and packaged into bottles or other containers. There are many ways to package ketchup depending on how it's sold and used. Glass bottles are durable and provide a high quality packaging option. Glass bottles can be used for both small and large quantities of ketchup, and they are easy to sterilize and reuse. Plastic bottles are often used for large quantities of ketchup, as they are lightweight and more cost effective than glass bottles. Squeeze bottles are often used in restaurants and other food service settings. Ketchup packets are small, single-serving packets of ketchup that are often used in fast food restaurants and other food service settings. These packets are convenient and easy to use, and are often made from foil or plastic to keep the ketchup fresh. Ketchup is a widely popular condiment that is used in a variety of dishes and cuisines around the world. Because of its sweet and tangy flavor, it pairs well with many different foods. One of the most common ways to use ketchup is as a topping for burgers, hot dogs, and other types of sandwiches. In the United States alone, Americans consume roughly 20 billion hot dogs each year, many of which come with the tangy ketchup condiment. Ketchup is also often used as a dipping sauce for fries and other types of fried foods. In addition to these traditional uses, Ketchup can also be used in a variety of recipes to add flavor and moisture to dishes. Ketchup is one of the main ingredients in barbecue sauce and a common flavoring and moisture ingredient in meatloaf and other dishes. It can also be used as a marinade for grilling or roasting meats, as the acidity in the ketchup helps to tenderize the meat. In Asia, ketchup is often used as a sauce for Asian dishes, like stir fries and noodle dishes. In these dishes, ketchup is combined with other ingredients like soy sauce and vinegar to create a sweet and tangy sauce. From barbecues to ball games, ketchup might be the world's most famous condiment. It is a staple at almost every summer gathering and can be found on tables in restaurants and homes around the world. Ketchup continues to evolve and is now enjoyed in many different forms and flavors, from the classic tomato variety to unique flavors such as sriracha and garlic. Condiments are an important aspect of many types of cuisine because they add flavor, moisture, and visual appeal to a dish. They can also be used to add a burst of flavor to a dish that may be bland or monotonous on its own. Condiments can also be used to add texture and a variety to a dish, such as the crunch of pickles on a sandwich, the creaminess of mayonnaise, or the tanginess of Heinz tomato ketchup. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for new videos.